Great greetings, everyone. Najat Media here, and welcome to Ratchet Deadlocked. Yo. Yeah. Um. Great greetings, everyone. I just already said that. Did you say that? Great greetings. Great greetings. Great, great, great greetings. greetings. Great, great greetings. greetings. Great greetings. Great greetings. <laughs> uh, welcome. And we are at the final part of the ghost station. Hopefully. hope we are at the end of this. I hope we're in this final part. But, um. Yeah. As you can see. Oh, yeah, there we go. Ooh, that was pretty fast. Yeah, it was pretty fast, wasn't it? Now, we could stick around for the drop ships. So, we're gonna do that. There we go. Get that one. Get, get it. Alright. Alright, where's the third one? There we go. Get that one. Alright, destroy it. And then there's gonna be one more. There we go. And get that one. Boom! Wait, what? Alright. Alright, let's get out of here. And head off to the next mission. Gotta do these swing shots again. Oh man. What's even worse about the swing shots is that you can't do a double jump off of them. Like, you're literally just stuck with what the uh, momentum gives you. I mean, it's better here than it is at that awful rail section. But, you know. It's in the Tower of Power remake. Which I will con continuously rant about for the rest of this LP because it's awful. But, you know. There's a band called Tower of Power as well. Mm. Not sure if they're still active or not. Who knows? Nothing's easy in the red zone, baby. I'm interrupting Dallas's conversation. I guess send us to the grave that all these ghosts are, so we turn into ghosts, that way we have to fight the next person who manages to get up this far, so is that the idea, I guess, Dallas, Texas, but, um, today, we're recording this actually on the same day as the Miraxis and Liberator tournament, just in a different session. Because you can't have multiple sessions in the same day. We, we don't really do that this that much. It's just the reason to why we're doing two sessions today is because we missed out on one pre yesterday. So we're making up for it today. So, there you, so there's a little hint, I guess, to our recording schedule. Alright. I like the look of this place. It looks completely different than the other three levels in this stage. But it's a decent change. Alright. Now this is where our hover ship actually is. So, you don't actually have to keep that in mind. You don't have to backtrack. Because you automatically go to it. But, uh... Alright, where are we? I mean, I know where we are, we're in the ghost station, but I'm just, I don't know, I'm kind of running stay on commentary. We're in the, uh, we're in the United States, uh, the planet Earth, third planet from the sun. In the galaxy of the Milky Way, right, right in, which is right next to the galaxy of the Snicker Bar. Yeah. And, and the Twig <laughs> and the... I'm a Reese's man myself. Um, I mean... Yeah, I'm not a big fan of Snickers. I love Snickers. But that was the first thing that came to mind, and that's probably like the candy that's, I guess, closest to a Milky Way. And my favorite way to eat a Snickers is to put it in the refrigerator for a few minutes, get it kind of cold, and have some ice cold milk with it. It is so good. Alright, let's destroy these computers. Get blown up. Property damage. Boom. Has 
eventually survive through the ghost station's infamous gauntlet of doom. It looks like it's all over. Or is it? Ratchet, we must make sure they can never use the station again. Destroy the station's outer turrets that guard the power cores. Then, destroy the central core and bring the station down. We will be so, in order to escape, we have to destroy the place, even though we can just fly off. But, uh, you know... I keep forgetting that I could just spam the button for this thing. I don't actually have to hold it down. We have a ton of nodes to collect, so we're not to collect to destroy. And it's always nodes with this game, too. Alright. So I always lose where these where some of the nodes are. Alright, let's see. Because the way that this, like, stage is kind of colored, it kind of gets a bit confusing. Because these things start to blend in with the environment. Not always, but they sometimes do. Let's see, there's one under here. Alright. Where? There is one under here. But it's not so are the yeah, I guess these things are the nodes. Yeah. I guess they are, but alright. Oh yeah, you gotta get through the the shield and the fort. Yeah. Alright. Jam, back me up here. I'm getting stale on commentary. Okay, um that's a big horseshoe right there. Horseshoe. So, you know, as, as I mentioned before, this game seems to be inspired somewhat by uh, The Running Man. There's a lot of similarities. Some dialogue that's very similar. Some characters in here that seem to be based on characters from the movie. Um... I highly suggest that uh, if y'all enjoy this game, you might enjoy The Running Man. It's a pretty cool movie. But now we're flying upwards to go destroy. How cool is it, by the way? Ice. It's ice. We're almost done with yes, the... Yes, Arnold is in that movie. Yeah. We're almost done here. We almost have the ghost station destroyed. We almost never have to worry about... other contestants having to deal with this course. And we're almost finished with the game. Oh, I did it out of order. I destroyed the brains. I did it out of order. I destroyed a lot of the green things. Ratchet, I have found a way to shut down the containment fields and release all the heroes. You're kidding. That's amazing. He's had hell. Not Al? You're alive. You said your body was beyond repair. No biggie. I got a new one. Okay. So, what's the plan? We have acquired schematics for the entire battle zone. Computer on the control level that regulates power to the containment fields. So what? Reprogram it? Hack it? Blast it. Just blow it up and the fields go down. Okay, so how do I get to the control level? I have reprogrammed the battle dome shuttle to take you there. But it is a one-way ride. 